Olivia Newton-John, the beloved star of Greece and singer of countless hits, has died. She was 73. Newton-John fought a public battle with breast cancer for the past 30 years, establishing the Olivia Newton-John Foundation Fund and inspiring fans around the world. Newton-John's rep told TMZ she died at her Southern California ranch peacefully Monday morning. Dame Olivia Newton-John passed away peacefully at her ranch in Southern California this morning, surrounded by family and friends. We ask that everyone please respect the family's privacy during this very difficult time, Newton-John's husband, John Easterling, announced on her Facebook page. She is survived by Easterling, daughter Chloe Latanzi, brother Toby Newton-John, nieces and nephews Tot Ty, Fiona and Brett Goldsmith, Emerson, Charlie, Zach, Jeremy, Randall, and Piers Newton-John, Jude Newtonstock, Layla Lee, Kira and Tasha Edelstein, and Bryn and Valerie Hall, Olivia has been a symbol of triumphs and hope for over 30 years sharing her journey with breast cancer. Newton-John's family said, her healing inspiration and pioneering experience with plant medicine continue with the Olivia Newton-John Foundation Fund, dedicated to researching plant medicine and cancer. In lieu of flowers, the family asks that any donations be made in her memory to the Olivia Newton-John Foundation Fund. Newton-John was born in Cambridge, England on September 26, 1948, and was the youngest of three children. When she was six years old, her family moved to Melbourne, Australia. She began performing as a teenager and released her first single in 1966. She got her first taste of international success in 1971 when she released her first solo album, If Not For You. The title track, a cover of the Bob Dylan song, also became a hit in the US. In 1974, she represented the UK at the Eurovision Song Contest performing Long Live Love, which helped her expand her reach. That same year, she also released what would become her signature song, I Honestly Love You. Following a string of successful singles, Newton-John cemented her status as a superstar when she was cast as Sandy in Greece, opposite John Travolta. Newton-John's sparkling vocals turned You're the One That I Want, hopelessly devoted to you, and summer nights into pop classics that dominated the late 1970s charts, Newton-John's success continued into the 1980s, thanks in part to her best-selling single Physical. Even though Xanadu wasn't met with critical praise, the soundtrack provided her with more hit singles. Unfortunately, by 1985, her music was less popular as newer female stars began dominating the pop charts. In 1992, she was diagnosed with breast cancer for the first time and would devote the rest of her life to raising awareness of the disease. It charged the music she picked to record and how she could promote her work. In May 2017, her breast cancer returned and metastasized to her lower back. She later revealed that she also had another bout with breast cancer in 2013, but did not speak out about it at the time. Newton John released her final album, Friends for Christmas in 2016. She also collaborated with Travolta many times throughout her career, most recently on the 2012 album This Christmas. Queen Elizabeth II appointed Newton-John a Dame Commander of the Order of the British Empire in 2020 to honour her services to charity, entertainment and cancer research. I don't know what I would be without it now. I see it as my life's journey. It gave me purpose and intention and taught me a lot about compassion, Newton-John told The Guardian in 2020 when asked about her cancer battle. It has been a gift. I don't wish it on anyone else. But for me, it's been important in my life, John Travolta is paying tribute to Olivia Newton-John. More than four decades after the two Hollywood A-listers shared the screen in 1978's Greece, Travolta on Monday penned an emotional tribute to his co-star and friend following news that Newton-John passed away earlier that morning following a decades-long battle with breast cancer. Travolta penned the heartbreaking message on Instagram Monday afternoon, where he shared a throwback photo of the actress, writing, My dearest Olivia, you made all of our lives so much better. 
The actor went on to reflect impact Newton-John not only had on him, but on the world, calling it impeccable. Travolta added, I love you so much. We will see you down the road, and we will all be together again. Yours from the moment I saw you and forever. He signed off on the post, Your Danny, Your John, a reference to his on-screen counterpart in Greece. Travolta's emotional and public tribute came just minutes after Newton John's husband, John Easterling, confirmed the beloved actress's passing in a message shared on the singer's verified Instagram account, reading, Dame Olivia Newton John passed away peacefully at her ranch in Southern California this morning, surrounded by family and friends. We ask that everyone please respect the family's privacy during this very difficult time. Olivia has been a symbol of triumphs and hope for over 30 years sharing her journey with breast cancer. At this time, Newton John's official cause of death has not been confirmed. Though a source told TMZ, after a 30-year cancer journey, she lost her battle to metastatic breast cancer. The 73-year-old had numerous public battles with cancer, including in in the early 90s and in 2017. In 2018, she shared that she was treating cancer at the base of her spine. Newton John was a major figure in Hollywood, easily cementing her place as one of the most recognizable figure in the world throughout the 70s and 80s. She is perhaps best known for portraying Sandy in Greece opposite Travolta's Danny, the hit 1978 film that includes the pop classics, You're the One That I Want, Hopelessly Devoted to You, and Summer Nights. The two, who remained close friends throughout the years, with Travolta in January even sharing a photo of himself and his family spending time with Newton John. Newton John is survived by her husband, daughter Chloe Latanzi, sister Sarah Newton John, brother Toby Newton John, and several nieces and nephews. Thank you for watching till the end. Please like the video and subscribe to the channel to see more interesting videos.